Hello everybody. Today we are going to practically identify dermatophytes. As you know, dermatophytes are a common level for group of three types of fungus. Genus Trichophyton, Microsporum and Epidermophyton that commonly cause skin, hair and nail disease. So on the basis of flowing features, site of infection, colonial morphology, origins of a spore like microconodia and macroconodia. So let's start from trichophyton. It affects hair, nail and skin. Trico means three. So it affects these three powderly pigmented clony, macroconadia abundant, whereas macroconadia pencil or cylindrical shaped. So let's watch the clip. Here you can see powderly pigmented clonies, and here you can see abundant macroconadia, isn't it? This, this this one this one many more microconadia in this field and about macroconadia pencil or cylindrical shape so here you can see pencil shape this one pencil shape pencil shape pencil shape pencil shape isn't it so the organism is trichophyton. Similarly, about microsporum, it affects hair and skin only. Clony, cotton like pigmented, microconadia, relatively scanty, and macroconadia, spindle shaped. Here, this one, this one, cotton like pigmented clonies. So, let's try to observe spore so here you can see scanty spores scanty spore isn't it and about macroconadia spindle shaped this one spindle shaped spindle shaped spindle shaped isn't it in this way we can evolve to identify microspore now about epidermophyton it affects skin and nail only powderly greenish yellow clony microconadia absent macroconadia club or pear shaped so let's watch the clip for practical identification so here we can see powderly greenish yellow clony so now about a spore so here in this field lacking microconadia no microconadia at all but pure shaped macroconadia this one we are saved. In this way, we can identify dermatophytes in your laboratory. I hope this clip will be helpful. Therefore.